family. It's laundry day. <laughs> and Hava is out here uh, getting her experience and uh, doing our laundry <laughs> here in the Gambia. What do you think about it, Hava? Actually, <laughs> it's uh, a free workout. <laughs> um, if you want to know my thoughts, uh, there's something kind of beautiful about it, but it is a lot of work. Uh, when we first came over here, I said I wasn't, I didn't want to pay anyone to do those types of things because I didn't want to come over here as a spoiled American um, trying to, uh, you know, I guess just live just a good life and have people do my dirty work um, and a lot of um, people have locals have been telling me to you know hire somebody to come and help me and I've just been like no I don't want to be that American but the thing is is that many of the Gambians not only is their body already conditioned for this type of work we got to build our stamina up to this kind of work. But we're also pumping money into the economy and giving people jobs who need it. So if you want to be one of those who get your workout, because you will get a workout. <laughs> but if you want one of those who want to get a workout and uh, do your own, that's fine. But there's absolutely nothing wrong with um, hiring someone to do this for you and, you know, putting more uh, Delasi in a local's household. So, what you think, Amadi? I'm on board with that. Yeah. It seems like a lot of hard work. Yeah, it is. It is. And I wanted to make certain that I had hot water to get my clothes clean. So we had to fill the tub up in the house and I started washing in the house in the bath bathroom and I realized how messy it was gonna be. And then I thought, I said, well, let me get Amadi to help me take it out since I have my hot water. And I'm rinsing it in cold, you know, because we don't have hot water out here. But um, yeah, the, the clothes, the, everything's coming clean, you know. Um, but yes, I think, um, from this point on, we, we did contact a lady yesterday who we really trust uh, that's gonna come in and help me at least wash and just do light cleaning because I, I wanna clean my house. I don't wanna mm -hmm. come over here and just be spoiled. Yeah, and this is someone we've known close to a year now. So yeah, yeah we, we, we trust her. Yeah, we do. So anyway, let's just... So where are you headed with that in your hand? Oh, let's, here we <clears throat> put up our little clothes line. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna hold up after we get all of this heavy stuff on it. But, um, I figure we get about 12 hours of sun a day. So I figure, uh, and it's pretty windy today. So I figure, um, I figure that's plenty of time to get it, to, to get them dry. So, I just did a little today, and the lady's coming up on Sunday, and she's going to finish up. But I just wanted to get our towels, our sheets, things that, you know, dirty quick. And uh, so, yeah, guys, this is, this is Africa, and it's beautiful. I never thought I would be smelling doing laundry, you know, washing each piece one at a time, but it's, it's something something beautiful about it. I know that's weird. Is that weird? Not at all. No, okay. It's something beautiful about it, but like I said, um, we, we're going to pump that money into the economy. And, yes, and, we are. And bless a family. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But that's all, guys. I got to finish this laundry, and then we're going shopping today. I might give you a little footage of that, too. But okay. anyway, that's enough for now. All right, family. <laughs> Y'all can say, tell somebody.